the don't drink that. Whoa, 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 don't drink that. I saw some guy slip something in there. What? Who? That guy. Thank you. The Mrs. Stins fire. We have been assigned a new house mom. I'd like you to meet Mrs. Stinsfire. Hello, girls! <laughs> to perform the Lorenzo von Matterhorn, here's what you'll need. Basic knowledge of website design and a very unique fake name. Now, select your target. Preferably a girl with a real nice phone. I'm Lorenzo von Matterhorn. Are you, like, famous or something? Then, as soon as you're gone, she gets out her phone and does an internet search for Lorenzo von Matterhorn. A series of fake websites, all devoted to the incredible life of Lorenzo von Matterhorn. Can I buy you a cup of coffee? Yes, please. <laughs> and it is on. I'm actually in a top secret government space program called Secret NASA, or SNASA. Wow, SNASA. Mm -hmm. I'm the bass player for Cheap Trick. He's not coming. What are you talking about? Never mind. Sir. He's not coming. He's not coming. <laughs> Such a fool. <laughs> I got left at the altar. Really? A genie comes out of it? Only if you rub it hard enough. Step one, tell a meddlesome female friend about the playbook. Step two, run a play on one of her co-workers making her so angry she steals the playbook. Step three, put on the scuba suit and tell her you're going to do one more scam called the scuba diver on the hot girl stand. Lily and the girl ask what the scuba diver is. Take off your mask, give them some spiel about your deep-seated insecurities, which don't really exist because, let's face it, you're awesome. Feeling bad for you, Lily talks you up to the girl who then agrees to go get coffee with you. And it is on. The Robin. Step one. Admit to yourself that you still have feelings for this girl. Step two, choose the completely wrong moment to make a drunken move after hanging out at a strip club. Step three, agree that you two don't work, locking the door on any future you could have to get. Find the person who annoys Robin most in the world and ask for her help. Explain everything to Patrice and hope she agrees to help. Pretend to be dating Patrice. Wait until Robin inevitably breaks into your place to find the playbook and show it to Patrice. After Patrice finds the playbook, have your first big fight. Prove your loyalty to Patrice by burning the playbook. And actually burn it. You don't need it anymore. Because your friends have no boundaries, they'll inevitably have an intervention for Robin. Tell only Ted about your plan to propose to Patrice. Wait and see if Ted tells Robin. And if he does... Barney's getting engaged. It means your best bro in the world has let go of Robin and has given you his blessing. Robin arrives at her favorite spot in the city and finds the secret final page of the playbook. The last play you'll ever run. Robin realizes she's standing underneath mistletoe. Turn it over. Iceman to deliver this package to a girl named Lisa and that I'd recognize her because she'd be the most beautiful girl in this bar. Uh, I am definitely not Lisa, but I would be happy to help you find her. Great. And then, maybe later, I could give you a different package. My penis. Are you all right? Tomorrow I'm donating a kidney to my best friend. Just wanted to grab one last drink in case, you know, I don't make it. You are so brave. Hey, listen, <clears throat> before I give my best friend this organ, how about I give you a different organ? My penis. This play is extremely complicated. Let me guess, does it involve me saying my penis in a Scottish accent? Now you're getting it, laddie. The mannequin, where, as in the 80s classic, I magically come to life. The gym nacho, where I wait till a girl mentions something she likes. Uh, I love nachos. Thank you. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Jim. Jim Nacho. <laughs> Inventor. 
of the Nacho.